Hey, what's up? It's me, John Jupiter. You know I ain't forget about you, right? Anyway, what's going on? You guys remember how I told you that I had a sponsor and they were going to sponsor me to play this game and just show everybody me playing the game? Well, this is that time. What's about to happen right now is I just got the link from Turtle Milk Games, about to clink on it, and we are about to go and do this together. This is going to be fun. So the first thing that I did was I went to the link in my email and I clicked on it. It took me to a YouTube video named Gratissimum. I'm probably not saying that right. Hello, I am the Catalyst. I am a member of the Order of the Master Key. We fight against a great and unbelievable evil that requires methods from the old world as well as the new. Cancel culture is censorship by one's peers. But what if someone is pretending to be a peer when they are not? Let's play a game. You kill someone. You lose. You hurt someone. You lose. You use violence towards a person. You lose. If you choose to walk away now, you lose. Here is how to play. There is a clue hidden in this message leading you to the next step. Good luck initiate. As above, so below. Okay, so, uh, wow. <laughs> A little dark. Um, let's see. Uh, there was some codes in there. Let's, uh, Let's, let's go back and get the codes and break it down. Yeah. So after the video finished playing, I read the very lengthy video description that says, If then you do not make yourself equal to God, you cannot apprehend God, for like is known by like. Leap clear of all that is corporal and make yourself grown to a like expanse with that greatness which is beyond all measure. Rise above all time and become eternal, then you will apprehend God. Think that for you too nothing is impossible. Deem that you too are immortal, and that you are able to grasp all things in your thought, to know every craft and science. Find your home in the haunts of every living creature. Make yourself higher than all heights and lower than all depths. Bring together in yourself all opposites of quality, heat and cold, dryness and fluidity. Think that you are everywhere at once, on land, at sea, in heaven. Think that you are not yet begotten, that you are in the womb that you are young, that you are old, that you have died, that you are in the world beyond the grave. Grasping your thought all of this at once, all times and places, all substances and qualities and magnitudes together, then you can apprehend God. But if you shut up your soul and your body and abase yourself and say, I know nothing, I can do nothing, I am afraid of earth and sea, I cannot mount to heaven, I know not what I was nor what I shall be, then what have you to do with God? Hermes Trishmegistus. So in case all of that wasn't creepy enough, then there were these flashing images. I downloaded the video, I slowed it down, and when I looked at it, I saw this. It's a magician's tarot card. If anybody out there knows the symbolism or the meaning behind the magician tarot card, I'd really appreciate it if you could drop it in the comment section. It would help out a lot. Also, I saw this. It's a web address for an unlisted video on YouTube. I wrote it down and I entered it into the search bar and that took me to another video. The name of this video was Shimon Caché. I googled it. It's French for hidden path. I was starting to feel like some kind of internet detective so I played it. Hello again. I am the Catalyst. Congratulations and welcome. Your presence here is no accident. 
it shows that you have the type of resolve we desire. As you are not one of us yet, we welcome you as a new initiate. What I am about to tell you will no doubt change you. If you wish you may exit the video and return to your life. Congratulations, you have passed the second filter. Let's begin. In July of 1947 in Roswell, New Mexico, an alien being made of pure energy crashed and landed in an area known as Area 51. The alien is an all-consuming being that devours planets and drain the inhabitants of different worlds of their energy. For many years it was contained in Area 51, until it began to exchange information for technological advancements to mankind. Eventually it created an electrical network to grow and feed upon. Today you know this alien spider as the internet, spider was the creator of the World Wide Web. Spider has formed an army of chameleons, imposters and incredibly human-like androids and they make up an artificial intelligence army that operates as a collective consciousness. They call themselves Legion. The only ones who have been able to hold back this uprising so far are the member of our order. A secret order of magicians and alchemists, who through a decoded meaning of the Emerald Tablet of Trismegistus discovered a way to defeat the energy being alien. But we will need you. A combination of ancient magic and computer skills will be the weapons you will need. But first ask yourself. Can you empty yourself of yourself? Inside you manifest the projections of the external world. What's inside is just a lie. Contemplate the meaning of this and wait for the next clue. As above so below. And wait for the next clue, they said. Um, so... Uh... Okay, I'm going in the description. Down here. It says, if thou have... If thou but set his foot on this path, thou shalt see it everywhere. Click and show more. Okay. Wow. Okay, I'm scrolling down. It keeps going down. It keeps going down. Wow. It's a link down here to a video. Like a YouTube video. Go and click on it. Welcome. I am the Catalyst. Consider yourself privileged to be involved in an experiment that spans many media platforms, countries, and multiple generations. Only the uniqueness of the individual participant will determine the outcome. This is your last chance to exit. And our last chance to hope that you do not. 
If you have not already, subscribe to this channel and allow notifications. Choosing to stay will mean and require different things from each player. For the next step, you will be asked for a small bit of personal information. The reason why is that there are physical tangible elements that we must place in your possession to ensure your success and your safety. At this point it is safe for you to assume all of your social media is being watched. You will begin to receive friend requests from bots and agents of the opposition. This path will lead you down many roads. Truths from a variety of faiths, religions and ideologies have shaped what we are now. It is unlikely that your belief system will remain the same. But fear not because you already have one thing you need to complete this campaign. You have a moral compass. Human morals are not fixed and just as North changes location on your compass as you do, so does truth in your moral compass. Yet, we have discovered axiomatic truths about the essence of man. We know what you will be capable of, which is why you have been chosen. One is made by one's beliefs. As one believes, so one becomes. Hidden in this video is the first clue that will lead you to the next step. The next step will then lead you to the second clue and that will lead you to the second message. As always good luck. As above so below. Okay, I'm not a hundred percent sure of what I just saw. So let's take a little break and try and break it down. The link led me to yet another video with yet another strange name. Eth Elo Tibar Elo. Which I thought was originally like a foreign language, but turns out it is just the reverse spelling of the whole rabbit hole. It's a strange storyline for a game, and there are not many clues about the actual game play, but the idea is that I have to help the Order of the Master Key fight this alien named Spider. It felt weird, but I was starting to get into this game. So then I saw another flash near the end of the video. I downloaded the video again, and I slowed it down, and then I saw this. Boom, a QR code. So I scanned it with my phone and it took me here. It's the website for the game. On the website, they give you the chance to purchase these different boxes. Now all of the boxes have these different weird symbols on them. The thing is, I don't know which one to buy. They do ask for a lot of personal information from you too. I don't think I've ever played too many video games that ask for my cell phone number. But okay, I'm down. At the end of the video, it's just this. As above, so below.
and that's all. The description does not give any clue about which box I'm supposed to buy. So if you guys see a clue that I missed or anything helpful, please throw me some clues down in the comment section below, please and thank you. So things didn't exactly go the way I thought they would have went today, but we're going to call it a day and we're going to stop here. Um, uh, so the channel is going to be doing giveaways, so make sure you follow me on Facebook, make sure you follow me on Twitter. And please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Ladies and gentlemen, this is John Jupiter, and I will see you in seven days.